just want to make a little video to say the, the pure benefits that I received from being pretty much very close to all raw food, nothing cooked except for some rice milk or maybe maybe powder. No, I don't think I've had any powder. So basically just a little bit of rice milk in the last like two weeks, but that was at the beginning. So yeah, I've been all raw for the last week or so. I've been 99% raw for the last, for the first week. So just over two weeks raw, okay? Raw vegan. So I want to report my benefits, okay? So I woke up at, one of my favorite ones is I woke up at 4.20 a.m. today. Um, I got the most sleep I had in a good few days, which was seven hours 20 approximately, because I went to bed at around 9, 9.30, 9 sleep probably. Um, so 9.30 to 4.20, that's like two and a half hour, two and a half hours, and then four hours 20, so six, six hours 50. I don't know. Maybe I went to bed at like 9 o'clock, but I probably didn't sleep until around quarter past half nine. So yeah, anyway, in around seven hours sleep. The last two days before that, I woke up at 4, not 4.20, but 4.50, which I think is very good for me. I'm very happy with that. So I'm needing around two to three hours less sleep per night because I'm doing, like, I'm just doing like more like conscious intermittent fasting, which I don't even call it intermittent fasting because it's not a fast. I'm basically just giving my, my digestive system a good break and I'm not overeating. So humans, because we overeat so much, call that fasting, which is not at all. Like, <laughs> we even call like cleansing or feasting fasting, like going on juices or going just fruits for a few days, like it's, if it's a juice fast. It's not a fast, that's liquid food. Fasting is just only water or else no water, which is called a dry fast. Um, but yeah, so I've, the other benefits I've had is I've and um, I'm just my eyesight's improved. Um, I've definitely improved. Um, it just feels like one of less eye fatigue by a little bit, not by a lot now, because I do. I'm actually I'm awake for an extra two, two, two and a half, three, maybe two and a half hours possibly per day. So and I am using my phone more, but I, my eyes are a bit better for sure. Um, a little bit clearer and kind of cleaner, crisper. Like my vision, my sight's better. For sure and my overall eye fatigue is better too my eyes just feel a little bit better and fresher it feels nicer and um, my biggest immediate difference i noticed was the elimination of mucus and, and from my nose and back of my throat face from the back of my throat um, and the clearing of my na na nasal passages and my sinuses so my breathing through my nose vastly improved and it's continued to improve and become better which i really love because breathing is like super important we're air creatures and it's super important not to have blocked breathing. So yeah, that's super important. Um, yeah, um, I, I'm not sure if I have overall more energy. I probably do, but some days I made mistakes, like I had too much orange juice for some of the days, um, which really just made me feel like like it was fresh orange juice. It's a bit acidic, kind of, you know, like it's naturally acidic, of course, but when I'm just eating like a lot of fair bit of fruits and stuff and maybe some almond milk or maybe some raw chocolate or maybe some cheese seed pudding, that's what I've more or less just been eating the last two weeks. Almost no nuts or seeds at all. Like I don't think I ate any nuts and seeds loosely, which I'm not against and it's more or less okay. We don't have too many. But yeah, it made me detox and feel like it was zapping me of my energy. The energy I felt bad. Not good, so I didn't like that. I made me feel really tired in the evening. But as a daddy to three kids, you know, it's just so important for me to have more time to myself, more waking hours. One for my own leisure, for my own teaching and expressing myself to my my this channel and other working on my books, my book, my main book that I'm super excited about. And also doing better, more video editing, and just more production and then more housework, more getting things done. As well as just more time, like downtime and more learning. I've been learning and getting inspired by what I'm learning. Like Gillian Berry is my favorite, like my most recent favorite YouTube channel I've been getting inspired from and learning from. So she's cool. She's a raw food vegan for 50, for five years. Um, yeah, just more consumption of positive material and then also more production of positive material and more quiet, quietness or downtime to myself, which I need to do. So, yeah. They're my favorite benefits. I just think being awake longer is the best because you have more life, like you're living longer instead of sleeping. So, the more we simplify our diet, the, the less energy we spend, the more, the less sleep we need, the more, the more we're awake, the more we live. So, 
It's all about simplicity instead of varied and complex. So you want simple instead of varied and complex. So a lot of raw food diets, a lot of ordinary diets, cooked vegan, cooked omnivore, cooked vegetarian. One, it's cooked, so it's, it's very altered and processed, and it's varied, you eat loads of ingredients, so you, you just lose, load, lose loads of time sleeping to recover and to clean yourself from that. Same as the raw, raw vegan, like if you're gonna like make stuff, like salads and fancy raw, and just combine ingredients in a meal, you will, depending on the complexity, or if it's dehydrated, or how much very very of food you're eating in a day, the more you'll sleep. So I'm I'm now 39 in my body, so I'm very interested in like saving time and having more waking hours to live and to to enjoy and to get things done. You know, busy man, busy daddy. I love being a daddy so much. It's the best thing in the world. My favorite thing. I just love it so much. My favorite, 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 favorite. Very tough, challenging, and hard job at times, for sure. But it's the most important, the sweetest role, task, duty, responsibility to be a guardian and to be a nurturer and a, a loving, caring protector as well. Beautiful thing, the connection. If you're, so working on conscious parenting and conscious living has been a divine joy. Which brings me to another point, my mood. My mood and um, I'd say my overall energy has increased, to be honest. But um, yeah, so my energy and especially my mood overall has improved, except for when it's when it's not improved by having too much orange juice. Like don't want to detox too fast. Like some stuff's too strong. One one night I had a pineapple. Oh my goodness, gave me a red a red little lip and tongue. It was like too, pineapples can be too acidic. They don't ripen after they're picked. A lot of fruits do, but pineapples don't. So the ones I get in Ireland, like even though it was orange, is good enough. Yeah, the part closest to the, the, the big like leaves is the most acidic and on the bottom is the most like sweetest and less acidic. But I had the whole pineapple and ooh, it conked me out. <laughs> and that night I slept a lot and I felt like shit the next day actually. That was the worst day I felt. That was day two of just fruits. I had to end it in the evening, then I actually yeah, did I end it in the evening? Yeah, in the evening I ended up like having some others, some like you know, raw chocolate probably or some like almonds or almond milk or something something heavier, you know, maybe some salad, avocado and salt and stuff like that, avocado and bouillon. But yeah, that's what I've been eating like as well, like avocado and bouillon and nutritional yeast and apple cider vinegar with blended and strained garlic, ginger, cayenne pepper, turmeric and onion. It's called dragon fire. So you use apple cider vinegar, you blend it with those things, then you strain it and then you're left with dragon fire, which is what I just mentioned. So it's not just apple cider vinegar. Tasty, you know, it's nice. So I'm just trying to have like cooked food tasty type of stuff, but it's in it instead of having it on the, on the medium of start cooked starches, cooked oils, or cooked like like dead animals, which don't want to do that. I love animals so much, they're my friends, my family. Um, but you have it on a medium of like fresher raw food leaves like lettuce or, or avocado. So, it's so much healthier, so much easier to digest. But even that can sometimes put me in a bit of a lower mood tired especially if I have too much avocado or if I eat if I eat when I'm not even hungry which sometimes I do because I'm still a recovering like emotional eater so yeah um it's a lot of benefits I have to say tons yeah I like it I'm gonna keep doing it because I love it so much especially the whole more time more time in the evening more time in the, in the, when I wake up first just more time getting things done just being more creative and inspired which means so much because it feels great to be creative and inspired and then get things done with your creativity and inspiration so yeah i hope that video helps uh, loads of love so please feel welcome to share like subscribe leave any comments friend me on social media check my description links below you can see me there and if you friend me on uh, social media or facebook or mess like messenger just please leave me a little personal message say hi introduce yourself like how you know me or anything you want to share and I'll see you again next day and loads of love to you and your family. Carefully as all. One love, one family, unity consciousness.